designed specifically for the backcountry enthusiast who's headed out into the winter for any number of snow sports. The Osprey Women's Cresta 30 has enough capacity for a full day of adventure, whether you plan to hike, snowshoe, or do some skiing or snowboarding. It's got an array of winter-specific features, like options to carry skis, a snowboard, or snowshoes. You've got a designated goggle pocket and lots of other pockets for quick access to snow safety gear. It's got a built-in back pocket for a hydration reservoir, which actually routes through an insulated shoulder harness to prevent freezing. The back panel easily helps you carry the load, and the shoulder straps and hip belt are specifically designed for those snow sports. So let's dig into all those features. A backpack like this is a lot different from a regular hiking pack in that you've got very specific features for those snow sports. I wanna turn this around just to talk about the back panel first. As you can see, you've got a really well padded shoulder harness and hip belt here. If you look at the back here, this is thermo formed contoured back panel. And you can see there's not a lot of mesh. There's not any places where snow could get caught in there and then melt on your back. So this is specifically designed to be out in the winter. You do have a light wire aluminum frame that goes around the outside here, so it gives a lot of rigidity. Even though this is a pretty small pack, it's got a pretty supportive back panel and suspension system because you've got carry options to put skis, a snowboard, or something like that on the pack, so it's gotta carry a lot of weight. And this pack does it really well. Osprey also has gender specific features on their packs and this pack is no exception. So you've got a torso length and just the width between the shoulder straps as well. Uh, the contour in the shoulder straps and the contours in the hip belt. So this is a women's specific pack and it's going to fit that much better because they have all of those features. Now looking at the back panel here, you've got uh, load lifter straps that actually come off with a, a buckle there and that is actually going to allow you access into the main body of this pack from the back and the reason they've done this is because if you're taking your pack off in the snow you don't necessarily want to put this back panel down onto the snow so when you put it back on, you're gonna have all that snow on you and you're gonna get wet. So they've designed it like this so that all you have to do is put the pack down on the ground and then your whole back panel stays dry. So I've got all the access I need to the contents of this pack. So this is the main body. I've just got a few things tucked away in here, but you can see that there's a lot of space back there. So anything that you would need to take with you on your adventure that day, you've got tucked away back in here. This also gives you dry access to this pocket. So because you've got some other uh, snow specific pockets on the front, uh, you actually have a separate compartment to keep all of those things dry. And then as you can see under the, the lid here, we do have kind of a key clip so smaller items don't get lost in the rest of the pack. So you have a nice little pocket up there. So this is a feature that I really love about this pack. It's something you don't necessarily think of, but it makes a huge difference when you're out all day. The other thing I wanna point out here is in between the back panel and this pocket, there is a hydration reservoir pocket. So you put your hydration reservoir right in there. You can hang it from a little loop there. And the hose to your hydration reservoir actually routes out through an insulated sleeve here on the shoulder harness. And anyone who's been out in really cold temperatures with a hydration reservoir knows that that uh, hose is liable to freeze if you're not if you don't have it insulated so it's in there and it's not going to freeze so you'll have drinkable water all day long now as i zip this up i want to point out that these zipper pulls are a lot bigger they're glove friendly so when you're wearing gloves these are a lot bigger that you can actually get a hold of those and they're really easy to zip those are all throughout the pack the other thing that osprey's done is all the clips 
are also glove friendly. So it's really easy to just pinch those and uh, remove those clips. Those are also all over the pack. Now if we go down to the bottom, you can see you do have a nice uh, sternum strap with a safety whistle on it. And then the hip belt here is also contoured nice and padded. You've got adjustability there and then nice big pockets on the front of the hip belt. I've just got a phone tucked away in there. As far as all the other features, we're gonna turn the pack around and talk about all those snow specific features that make this pack so unique. Starting at the top here, you have a nice carry handle that can easily access with gloves. Designated goggle pocket. And this is actually a really soft material, so it is easy on those goggles and they fit really nicely in there. And that way the goggles aren't somewhere on the bottom of your pack getting crushed. You've got plenty of options for ski or snowboard carry here, so I just wanna point those out really quickly. You've got horizontal clips here, so you can easily carry a snowboard on there, even a pair of snowshoes. You have A-frame and diagonal ski carry options with this pack as well. And on the front, you actually have a included pocket here that has a helmet carry. So if I open that up, you've just got a stretchy piece of material there that you can take your helmet and actually store it on the top. All of the points on this pack that would come into contact with hard gear, like the hard side of your snowboard or skis, are actually reinforced. It's a really durable material, and even the front of this pack has a very durable material. So on all of those wear points, you can be certain that it's gonna last a long time. You do have an ice axe loop down here, so you just have one on this pack. It is a smaller pack. And then you can see all the compression straps on the sides and the ability to carry skis a different way there. So plenty of different carry options. Now, inside the pack, you've got plenty of pockets for all sorts of gear. Now, if I uncover this pocket, you can see that it has a red zipper pull on there and that stands for safety gear. It's right on the outside. It's really easy to get to all of that safety gear. Here I've got a pocket for a shovel handle. This other pocket is for an avalanche probe and then I've got the rest of my shovel down in there. So this is a nice big pocket. You also have a mesh pocket up here for smaller items that you don't wanna get lost down in the bottom. This is great because it keeps that gear that might get wet or a gear that might have snow on it, it keeps it away from the main body. So you've got kind of a wet pocket and a dry pocket here. So Osprey's really thought of everything with this pack. You can carry lots of water, you can carry all your gear, and all of those small designated pockets make it great for those snow sports. You can carry any a number of gear on the outside of this pack, and you can ensure that this is gonna give you a great day out in the snow. It's the Osprey Women's Cresta 30 liter pack.